going back to my high school, Brother Martin High School, where I had Marty Hurley as my band director and drum instructor and eventually private teacher. I feel like I am where I am in my career because of some of those principles that I learned from him. We're gonna see the drum line in its current state and I might even sit in a little bit and play one of the cadences that Marty wrote and we might even do a little bit of a master class. So it's gonna be fun to go back to school and, uh, and share a little bit of what I've learned since I've been there. All right, we're back here at Brother Martin High School, where I went to high school, and where these two gentlemen also went to high school. And Chris Bailey was a senior when I came in at eighth grade. He was big man on campus. He was winning all state, and he was the drum. He was the drum major, and and Dominic, you were the drum major the year before Chris, correct? correct? That's correct. Yeah. So I came to Brother Martin because I heard that they had the best drum line in town. <laughs> Without a doubt. Yeah, so, and that was because of Mr. Hurley. That, that is true. And I didn't know who Mr. Hurley was yet, but when I got here, I quickly found out. And I was like, man, this guy is gruff. And, and but then I realized, well, I can't do what he can do. And I can't, why. yes, and I can't do what all these elder classmen can do. So I better just keep my mouth shut and learn from this guy. And I started getting serious in about sophomore year, started taking privately with him, told him I want to be the drum captain and I want to win all state. And he, you can imagine, he was like, oh, that's going to take a lot of work. I was like, I'm, I'm willing to do the work. So I learned my work ethic from him. I learned my discipline from him. I learned my sense of always striving for excellence from him. In addition to all the rudimental, fundamental foundational stuff that I learned. So we thought it would be fun to come back here, visit y'all, and see what the drum line is up to. Typical day at Brother Martin, the, the drum line's in there rehearsing, running through some cadences. We were hoping you could play along with them. If y'all will have me. Definitely. <laughs> nice, awesome. Let's go check out and see what they're doing. We are very, very lucky to have Stanton Moore here. He's known, as you guys know, for you know his New Orleans drum playing, but like he has that rudimental background because he went to Brother Martin High School. He's one of our grads. He does so much for us, but the fact that he's here today, we really, really appreciate it. Thank you, Chris. All right, Stanton. Yes, indeed. Well, I got to interact with some of you yesterday, and that was a blast. Hopefully, y'all had fun. That's super fun to be able to set up a kit in front of a line and play with y'all. Y'all sound great. Keep up the great work. You're in great hands with Mr. Bailey. I came here as an eighth grader and started with Mr. Hurley on two Formica tables. I didn't know anything. 
and he coached me up. Foot on the floor. Check this out. Ooh. Good job. Y'all are swinging now. Drums is just uniquely therapeutic. Like, uh, there are a lot of times, you know, going through high school, getting tons of homework assignments, just being able to drop all that, just pick up a pair of sticks, and like, like you said, just start smacking stuff with them. Yeah. It's great. Yeah! So much progress. Great, man. It's all about making the music that you're playing and the musicians that you're playing with feel good. Ba -da -ba -ba. It's the backbone for the band. I like how it provides structure and you can still be melodic with it, so that's very interesting. Because it's like people like Jake, people like you, who went here and they just like graduated and became world-renowned drummers. It's like proof, living proof that you can, that, that we can do it. It shows that if you have a dream and you have a will, you will find a way to do whatever you want in life if you simply put your mind to it. What separates something from being good or great is the attention to detail. So right now, I'm gonna show you a detail that's gonna make this sound so much better. Mr. Bailey, you heard what they sounded like just then? Watch what they're about to sound like. When we're playing drum set a lot, we're trying to get people to dance. So imagine somebody at a second line dancing down the street, right? So that note, that note has to be a little bit more swung and a little bit more accented. So we're putting a little bit of weight on that note. Listen to the way I'm playing it then I want you to add that weight to that one E and A, uh, three E and A. Uh. And y'all are funky, y'all are grooving. At Brother Martin, we're not technically like a competitive marching band, right? So we'll take all guys at all levels. We take the guys straight out of beginner band, and you know, the next step is marching band. And even if they aren't like really at an advanced level, we figure out a way to continue to train them. Nick, so much better, so much better. That's great. Guys can't just sit on their laurels. They have to definitely work hard or people are gonna be passing them up. And that's what happens in life too, you know? Ended up coming here and had a, had a blast. I was yeah. here for three years from 2017 through 2019. Cool. So class of 2019. Yeah, great. Three years. And then once you heard the Brother Martin drum line, were you like, oh, that, that's, that was the big thing, yeah. That's where I, I need to be. We would play them in football games and I would see the eight snares, like four or five quads, massive drum line, just like, and they sounded great, and I was like, oh, I was like, I have to go there. <laughs> Good to see you, Jake. See you as well, thank you so much. Yeah, man. The goals that you set here and that you work towards, that's gonna train you for the rest of your life, that you can set goals and accomplish anything you want. If you dug this video, please hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified when I am coming out with new lessons or behind the scenes footage. Thank you all for tuning in and I'll see you down the line.